how you spell that. We're playing it on BBC Lincolnshire. Introducing. <laughs> BBC. Introducing. So let's catch up with promoter Chris Pearson. Anyone who supports new music in the county is all right by us. And uh, Chris, Chris Pearson, for the past uh, few months, has been running Hey Now Promotions, uh, sorting out uh, gigs for bands uh, locally, uh, places like Marshall's Yard in Gainsborough, and uh, has got some uh, plans for a new venue in Lincoln. I've been speaking to him and asked him, if I was a band, what could he do for me? We work with various artists, sort of semi-professional artists and, uh, and unsigned bands from around, uh, around Lincolnshire, um, basically with a view of um, putting on some gigs locally um, in some unusual places you maybe wouldn't think of um, and some, some up-and-coming venues. So looking to get those bands on a decent stage, on a decent bill with some uh, some signs, touring bands, um, but also to, to get those bands a bit of exposure and uh, and sort of work across the country that they, they wouldn't normally get. You've uh, been doing this uh, for a few months already. You've got hopefully a series of gigs coming up um, at the showroom, this new venue in Lincoln. Yeah. Just tell us what yeah. the showroom is, because for a lot of people, uh, it's only been open, you know, a few months. We won't have heard of mm. it. No, it's a, a brand new venue. Um, I didn't really know much about it until about a month ago. Um, it's a £5 million venue, um, which says a lot, really, in Lincoln. Um, and it's it's a bit of a multi-use facility. It's got uh, it's split down the middle, and half of it is an activity centre with uh, all bits and pieces for people to do a climbing wall, indoor football, and all that kind of thing. And the other half of it is a, a venue and conference facility. So there's uh, a couple of rooms in there of various sizes, um, a little cafe with a big screen telly and all this sort of stuff um, in, going on in there. That's like cyber cafe, internet access, and all that kind of thing. Um, and it's can be used as a, a conference facility, PowerPoint presentation and stuff. Um, and then it also can be a music venue with a proper stage, a uh, big professional PA system and, and mixing desk lighting rig, which holds uh, 300 people. So uh, it's fairly unique in Lincoln because you've got uh, sort of local bars and pubs, which puts the fun. And then you've got the engine shed with 1500 capacity. Um, and I'm hoping that really this is going to uh, fit nicely in the middle and get those sorts of uh, up and coming bands and uh, and, and get them uh, get them into Lincoln. Yeah, and uh, this first gig that you're putting on there is in September, uh, yep. so not far away at all. Uh, just talk us through who you've got who you've got uh, performing that evening. Right, I've got uh, a band who I'm really pleased to bring to Lincoln. It's the first time that they've been here. Um, called Proud Mary, uh, a band that first I first heard back in 2001 when they signed to Noel Gallagher's record label. Um, and they've gone on uh, since then uh, a couple of labels down the line um, a couple of albums down the line and they're, they're playing still playing across the world um, and this is the last gig of the summer in the UK before they head to America uh, to record their fourth album OK, great stuff and uh, some local bands performing that evening as well, aren't there? Yeah, I've tried to get um, bands of similar sort of style of music uh, kind of indie uh, blues, rock sort of stuff um, I've got... Uh, Fantastic local bands, uh, Lost Souls, um, some good friends of mine, Little Limp, um, postcard from places that don't exist, and uh, the Ocean Hounds, and one more that's just come on, the 0.7s. So, uh, yeah, quite a few going on. I want to have a bit of a, a festival feel to it because it's the first one and uh, hopefully announce... Uh, announce the new venue with a with a bit of a bang. Great, and because, uh, I mean, you are working with quite a few different artists from uh, around the county who are in different genres as well. You're not strictly yeah. kind of indie, rocky bands. No, I mean, my, my, that is mainly my background, um, indie, indie rock bands with obviously the Idlers and Lounge Crusade, but uh, with Hey Now, I wanted to... Uh, to get uh, a bit of everything, I've got uh, an 11-piece African drum band. Um, I've got a solo jazz singer. I've got a couple of solo uh, soul bands that I work with, um, and uh, and all sorts of stuff. So yeah, sort of a bit of everything. And uh, for any sort of venues, pubs, and uh, and events that are on, we've we've probably got something that uh, a band that would would suit that. Uh, but we're always looking for more. OK, great stuff. And uh, if we want to get details of your gigs and uh, some more details uh, about you as well, uh, where should we mm. head? Uh, if you're on Facebook, um, it's facebook.com forward slash heynowmarketing um, and www.heynow.co.uk. 